Good night, princess. Is Nathan okay? When will I see him again? Oh. I don't know, honey. He hasn't left his office in three days. He loved his wife and daughter more than anything in the world. But we can try again tomorrow, okay? Get some sleep. What are you doing here? It's late. Go back to bed. What did you say? It was so quick. Mommy couldn't do anything. But it didn't hurt. Stop it, Jody. It didn't hurt at all. You hear me? Stop it right now! We are here, Nathan. We're right by your side. Helen. Laura. We love you, darling. I'll always love you. Talk to me again. Jody. Make them come back. Make them come back again! I can't. They've gone. Please. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. I miss them so much. The active condenser in the Republic of Kazakhstan has been destroyed and the rift is now inaccessible. We are now the only nation with access to the Infoworld. This situation opens up new strategic 
and military perspectives. Now we're going to launch new programs to discover possible energy resources and develop military applications. We've already found ways of linking entities to human soldiers, and this is just the beginning. Now, this is more important than the race to space or developing nuclear capability. We have discovered a new world. A world for us to conquer. This is the beginning of a new era for our nation. Pentagon top brass getting you down? They were busy talking about their plans to take over the world. So I left them to it. We played our part in all of this. I shouldn't have accepted that mission. I was only thinking about my freedom and that was stupid. What are you going to do now? I don't know. I think I need some time to... to figure it out. Figure out what I really want. <laughs> and what about you? The CIA has it all mapped out for me. Top tier, big car, golf meetings. I, mean, I haven't given them an answer yet, but... It's worth considering. Listen. Jody, I... I know it's been complicated between us. And I, I didn't always do the right thing. But maybe we could start again. You know, try and build something together. I mean, after all the stuff we've been through, maybe we could make it work. Worth a try. I will do whatever it takes to make you happy. You'll forget about all this. Ah, there you are. Nathan's looking for you. Come on, I'll take you to his office. Later, Ryan. Oh, you know what? I got a single malt in my office that needs sharing. Meet you in a few? Never say no to a single malt. <laughs> Great. I'll see you in a bit. Let's go, Jody. Nathan's waiting. Ryan's a good guy. And I think he really cares about you. Yeah. I just hope that Aiden was gonna get that too. Here we are. Call me when you're done, I'll come pick you up. <laughs> Whatever Nathan says, be careful.
Jody. Oh, I'm so glad to see you safe. I kept my part of the bargain. Now it's the CIA's turn. As far as the CIA is concerned, you no longer exist. You're now Elizabeth North. No identity and no life. Five hundred thousand dollars for services rendered. That should help make a new start. Thanks. Before you go, there's one last thing I'd like to ask. When my wife and daughter disappeared in that accident 15 years ago, I wanted to die too. I cried a lot, banging my head against the wall trying to figure out why, why, why them. Never being able to hold them again. It was like a wound that wouldn't heal. But then you came along. And I realized they were still here all the time, near me. I just couldn't see. They gave me everything I needed to study the infra-world. They were interested in military applications. I was interested in seeing my family again. It's taken me some years, but I finally succeeded in creating this. Hello, my darlings. If you, if you really 
really love them, you've got to let them go. You can't cheat death. Cheat death? Death is nothing! You hear me? Nothing! Goodbye, Nathan. Hi, Jody. Good to see you again. Well, you put us in a very difficult situation, you know that. We can't let you go. We can't kill you either. I don't know what you'll do on the other side. So there's only one appropriate solution. We inject you with a neuro acid, which will put you in a permanent coma. Exactly what we did with your mother. A simple and elegant way to put an end to our uh, collaboration. Goodbye, Johnny. We will always grateful for your help. Have to die anymore, no one will ever be separated again. What are you, what are you talking about? The containment field. I'm going to deactivate it. The infraworld will spread through our dimension. Life and death united in one world. Death, Jody. Everything's gonna be just fine. You need to trust me. Everything is gonna turn out fine. something else. Get help. Hurry. Where's the rest of your team? Ben's and Nick? <laughs> they have three months leave. 
They're on a beach on some exotic island, no doubt. Lucky bastards. Hey, I've got a couple of emails I need to send. You mind if I do that before we crack the bottle? No problem. Okay. you keep entities in this lab? Good God, no. They're all trapped behind the containment field. Aiden? Is that you, Aiden? If this is a joke, it's not funny. Why would I... What is it, Aiden? Where's Jody? Lead us to Jody, Aiden. Show us the way. This way. Over there. Okay, I get it. Want us to take the elevator? Is that it? Freeman, I have level three authorization. He's with me. Mm, I'm sorry, Mr. Freeman. You do not have the correct authorization for this level. Maybe you could make an exception. I just want to show him. Sorry, sir. This area is level four classified. You do not have the right credentials. You gotta get us past him, Aiden. Yes, 42, hello. Hello? Hello? I think you made a mistake. Could you check again, please? Cole Freeman and Ryan Clayton? I'm sorry, you are on the list. My apologies. Um, go on through. Thank you. Hurry, Aiden. Take us to Jody.